Definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success. I want to see how this plays out. Oh, lands an elbow. Plenty more where that came from. Big ball punch land. Now we get back to range. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Right hand upstairs. Right on the button. Nice knee to the midsection there. Nice punch to the head. Well placed kick there by Luke. Oh, huge Superman punch. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Oh, big Superman punch there. And he landed the right hand there. Single collar tie. All right, boy, Ty Clinch. A lot of elbows and knees could be coming from here. We'll see how he chooses to attack. Yeah, it's a very dangerous position, but an advantageous one for the offensive fighter. Watch for the defensive guy to try to break this immediately. Lee gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. Oh, well done to block that powerful kick to the body. Oh, yeah. Missed with that attempt. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Well, you're starting to see the damage now bleeding from his cheek. Oh, collar tie. That right hand hurt him a little bit. There's no tell on that leg kick. Clipped him with the right hand there. Unable to connect with the right hand there. Oh, how about that? He lands a huge kick. What a fight we got going on here. Oh. Oh, big left hook there. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, blocking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. Look at the skip action that allows you to land that big knee. And those knees aren't just for effect. Those are doing real damage. All right, so now we are on the ground. Now he is in his wheelhouse. We'll see if he can get one of his submissions to pop here tonight. He's having his way with him here. All right, side control now. We'll see if he can advance position. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. All right, close guard now. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Back to his feet. Oh, wow, his leg kicks are already taking effect. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas tank. Big punch land. Ooh. Oh, good head movement there. Nice slip. Oh, hard work pays off. Lands the Superman punch flush. Just misses with the jab there. Dribbling uppercut for it there. Twenty seconds to go in round one. Fifteen seconds. Nice punch lands over the top. All right, so a nice straight punch there after he caught the leg. He decides to punch out as opposed to going for any takedown.
take it. Horn sounds for the end of round one. All right, now we check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. How about the display of striking? Just high level. I mean, you would think that we're watching a K-1 level kickboxing match opposed to being in the UFC. Both displayed great technical skills, unbelievable striking. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets under. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Oh, big punch lands. Lee's hook shot gets blocked. The defense saw that one coming. Got clipped with the right hand. That is, oh man, this dude is good. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations here. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab, he may throw the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's gotta be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. Beautiful punch. Nice body kick. Just out of range with that right hand. Nice kick. Checks that leg kick. Not there. That's a big strike right there. Just missed with the straight left hand. Just over three minutes to go. Oh, going for the takedown here. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is a funny shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds an option. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one, and now starting to find himself in the puck. Man, look at the redness now, almost immediately on the right side of his body. Big kick. Both guys really throwing with authority. Ooh, Superman punch lands. Beautiful combination there. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Right under the elbow, the body can land. Nice connection with the punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this short. He's never looked this good. Well, at this point, he's got to be way up on the judges' scorecards, clearly winning the fight, and largely has gotten it done with his strike at the time. He got it done with his strike. He fought well behind the jab, but it was a significant strike that really did make an impact on the judges' mind. And they separate. Just out of range with that left hook. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. Nice. He lands an outside leg kick of his own. Oh, that's a good right hand. Mixes it up. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Now a knee. Oh! Oh, straight right. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Punch coming, it's blocked. Oh, well done moving the head there to slip that left hand. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. 
and they separate. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Ooh, blocks the shot. Ten seconds to go. And the horn sounds on round two. All right, so there's the end of the round. Few things in MMA more devastating than a head kick and nearly produced a knockout for him there. We talked to him earlier in the week, and he talked about chances to take the kicks high. He got a chance, he took it, he landed that kick and almost got the fight finished. Let's see if he can go and do that again. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them just really pick it up. Let's see who decides they're going to lead the dance as we go forward. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Oh, slips and rips. How about that for execution? Slips. Oh, nice. Nice. Oh, he landed that kick to the outside of the lead leg there, DC. He is chopping up that leg. They say chop down the street. You beat your opponent by slowing him down first with those nice outside legs. Well, he's certainly keeping busy, DC, connecting with most of the punches he's thrown. I mean, punches in punches. He's doing a great job. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Nice punch land. Right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Nice jab by him there. He's going nose hunting tonight, huh? Yeah, he's great with the jab. And not only as a setup, he really is trying to get damage off every time he throws his punch. Good jab. Oh, nice knee to the body. Very nice. He understands that doing the body work will pay dividends the longer the fight goes. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Superman punch lands! Just missed with the left there. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Well, I'm not sure how much more damage he can take to the body. You may want to drop that elbow defensively. Of course, that opens you up to damage upstairs. Pick your poison for him here as he continues to absorb damage. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Well, not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. How good is that right hand? Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Side kick lands for him there, champ. A lot of times that is used to manage space. You know, the kicks do hurt, right? These big body kicks, these high kicks, even though they're getting blocked, they do hurt. Head kick. Oh, effective use of the jab by Lee. Beautiful leg kick throw. Oh, Superman punch. Not always easy to execute. He did so there. Straight punch lands. 
well. He continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fight a little bit. Lesson one in boxing class, hands up, chin down. Nice leg kick. Swing and a miss with that straight left hand. Oh, is that a good knee to the body there by Lee? Just out of range with that strike. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Oh, he lands a massive kick here. That one is going to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> Seconds now to go in the round. Twenty seconds to go. Oh, the cut on that cheek is only getting worse. His face is a mess. Beautiful body kick. Lee's head kick looked like that one was blocked. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship rounds. All right, so the round is over. You see, obviously, the fighter has a cut on his cheek sustained in that round, but better to be below the eye than above it. The cut man is in there trying to close it up. Well, what a round it was. Daniel Cormier, you are one of the greatest mixed martial arts athletes of all time. I'm not sure you can do a Superman punch like that, though. With my luck, I would try to push off and my foot would be slippery, wet <laughs> or something. I would fall right into a knee. No, I would not try that. I don't have that ability. I'm not that free inside the octagon. All right, so next round underway here, and you got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp, and it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. Punch to the body is blocked. Outstanding kick there by Lee. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton, and to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. He's just being more aggressive, and because he's being more aggressive and more loose with his strikes, he's landed. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Look at him whip his hips into that kick. Glancing right hand lands upstairs. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Blocks the shot. Great punch. for the inside leg kick. Oh, Superman punch is good. Man, that cut is just getting worse by the minute. Rated R tonight. Pretty good right hand. Just over three minutes to go. Big right hook coming, it's blocked. Good punch, Lance. They continue to exchange. Oh, and the Superman punch is good. Big knee there to the chest. All right, then a left. Just out of range with that right hand. Big elbow. Oh, 
All right, two minutes now to go in the round. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if there's more where that came from. Boxing, boxing, boxing. He's got great kicks also. He needs to be throwing more kicks in this fight. He hasn't thrown uh, many at all. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Well, you shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Big head kick lands. An uppercut landed. Well, eventually, you know he's going to turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end thus far. They talk about the feeling out process. He's getting his opponent's timing. Now he's... Oh! That's how you finish your fight. He's got him hurt here. Right hand has been there at times, not that time. Oh, nice right hand. Big body kick land. Back and forth we go. Oh, Superman punches good. You can tell he's been working on that. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. That was lightning fast, that right hand. Jockey in for position here on the clinch. Both fighters trying to get him. from that previous round, DC, and what a display on the feet. Huge knockdown with that kick. Yeah, he's a high-level striker. He throws these kicks to the body, he throws them low, but when he goes up top, he's very powerful, and he can end anybody's night. The toughness displayed by his opponent allowed him to stay in the fight, but he cannot take many more of those types of strikes. Fifth and final round. Nice straight punch. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. How about it? Nice leg kick lands. Slips the shot. Well, missed on that one. Looking to land the right hand, he misses. That strike blocked by Lee. Oh, he lands the Superman punch. And they separate. How about that chin? Nice strike. Some nice back and forth action here. Big head kick lands. Misses with that punch. Throws the left hand. Big body kick. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything up. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Oh, and a nice jab by him there. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh, that's going to leave a mark. That right thigh really starting to show some bruising. All right, so he connects with another punch there, kind of targeting that cut. I mean, when you get a cut on your opponent and you see it and it's more blood, you continue to attack it. Every time you land, you can see that it splits a little bit more. Great job finding that weakness and really taking advantage of it. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. He's giving him so many different things right now. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he got it hurt bad. Wow. Wow. He's done. He's done. Oh, my goodness. What a fight. Pinpoint strike. 
to end this fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent wholly saw it coming. And before he could recover, the referee was in to stop the fight. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. All right, we'll take a look back at the highlights. You know we're going to find that nasty head kick somewhere in this highlight rip. Just an incredible result for him here tonight. A very nice head kick to finish the fight. But don't ignore all the work he did with his hands. And give credit to the opponent. The opponent was in there every step of the way. And in order to get a fight of the night like he got tonight, both guys have to be willing to participate. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 18 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon.